What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Hollow Toy, back in the saddle here with some online gameplay starting right out the gate. Give me that. Thank you. I'm the Houston Texans, and I'm playing against a, a young Kobe. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, young Kobe. He's a Falcons. Um, this was actually, I think, the first game that I played online ranked. Um... When I found out that I had the Houston Texans in the league, boom, sack, lunch. Oh, my goodness. So, usually when I find, figure out who my team is <clears throat> in my league, I'll take them online to see how they work or not work. And a lot of things I figured out about the game, this was like my first online game, I think maybe even the first night or something. You'll see my, my offense was really basic and my defense was super trash. As you can see, I gave up a touchdown right there. But because I got the turnover and I get the ball at the half, I'm already up and I just start breaking out the run game. Mr. Arian Foster, he is a beast, especially with this game, with the blocking. Oh, my. It's just, <clears throat> it's it's kind of insane. So as he's taking the ball, and I, I notice he can't stop. He, he got a real problem with strong close. And the thing about it, it you know, as I told tell you all the time, if somebody got a problem with something, keep running it until they fix the problem so you know and i said that aaron Foster with that with that run right there was just too much i was mixing in the, 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 the tackle with the dive with the counter i think i threw a toss in there too just for, just for old time's sake but uh you know he didn't just go away he didn't lay down or nothing he had some had some good defense himself but i had a lot of sacks on there but this it's a uh, I, you know, I found some old, old heat, but it still was no good as far as coverage was concerned. The Deep Blues, um, one thing you learn about Deep Blues is if you play them too close, they actually play like a flat route in the first couple steps. Um, they'll actually look in like they're looking for a play action or something and then just get burnt deep. It's just, it's insane how it works, but, you know, that's, that's one of the many flaws as far as defense is concerned, but, you know, it is what it is. I pushed him to fourth and goal. He hit the quarterback sneak, and uh, he got in to tie it back up. But, like I said, the run game is still still going hard. So, And, plus, I get the ball to half. So, I'm thinking if I can get the ball, get a score here, and keep him from scoring, that's that's just like a turnover, another turnover. So, I'll be up two. But I get, oof, oh, a little, little duping dive there, boy. It was just a um, couple things going on. I think uh, – Coach K just announced the second live Madden event, which is going to be November 23rd. I'll post a link of it to the description in the description. It's going to be out in, um, in New Jersey. Um, I think 2000, 2000 total. Um, I think 1500 to the winner and, and, uh, 500 second place, but Coach K, as anybody know, Coach K put on really good events. So, like I said, I'll put a link in the description for y'all to sign up. And you can you can actually um, go online and sign up online. It's actually a little bit cheaper than, than going for live events. I think it's 60 when you go at the door and 50 if you uh, sign up online. Don't quote me on that. Check it out for yourself, but that's usually how it goes. But, uh... Yeah, his event. A lot of a lot of events going on, man. October nineteenth, um, ATL Gaming Society doing one, a big one. Um, they're doing a tournament on the same day in Maryland. I mean, for everybody who say that the community is dead, it is not dead. I think right now it's the live as it's ever been, especially this early in the season. It's been a, it's already been two big tournaments and a whole bunch of small tournaments. I think there was a tournament this past weekend. Um, not sure who all went. If you did go, put a put a uh, put a little comment. Um, as far as every, as far as the channel goes, I want to thank everybody who's watching. I'm not getting a lot of views, uh, which kind of I don't know. It doesn't demotivate me, but I just kind of wish a lot of a lot more people would watch. So if y'all watch, for the people that are watching, if you like it, go ahead and hit it with a like and just tell everybody about it. I mean, you know, we out here doing this. I ain't the only one doing it. I know. But I've been doing this a little bit over a year now, I think, if I'm not mistaken. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> As I get roasted right there, there's another deep blue. But but anyway, I've been doing this a little bit over almost two years now. And, you know, I just, I, um, 
I see all the other guys getting all these monster views, and I'm like, man, what the hell? Oh, God. It's a soul stealer. Oh, jeez and rice. But, uh, but yeah, just uh, tell your friends about it. It's, you know, I usually put out good games. I try to stay away from the ones that everybody else do, like, you know, Niners, 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 49ers. Or, uh, Niners, 49ers. <laughs> what the hell am I talking about? Uh, Niners, Seahawks, 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 that sort of thing. But, uh, you know, I try to put on some entertaining stuff, but, you know, it is what it is. And uh, for you, for your, those of you who are watching it, I really appreciate it. Oh, man, he just, God, just the juke and jive. You can't just dive at him because you'll end up on your face with grass in your mouth. You can't do that. So, um, you know, just trying to do it big for uh, for Houston. Hey, we in the, we're at the Georgia Dome and trying to show them we ain't scared of nobody. But he gets out and gets loose on that one. Uh, to make it 42-20. Try to go for two on this one, but uh, we're going to go ahead and give them the, the uh, two-point version style. Give me that, thank you. <laughs> it's going to go real quick. But, you know, that was about the end of the game, I think, right there after this. After Oh, my. After he gets his first down, I think it's just, you know, all over but the grind. It's like, I, I go, I, I, I take out as much of the time as I, as I can between Ben Tate and Aria Foster. And I get all the way in the red zone, I think, and just decide I don't really feel like scoring, I guess. I don't know what the hell is wrong with me. Um, had everything working. Should have just kept going with what I had. Had a touchdown right there, but I took the right angle. You know, it's just making bad, bad choice, bad life decisions. So, anyway, went forward on fourth. She so didn't get it. Um, and, he, you know, he's still, still fighting. It's all good with him, but... As you can see, it's about to be all over the crown with the tip and the catch. So, anyway, thanks everybody for watching. And until next time, it's your boy Hollow Peace.